Christmas two years ago, I, Eddie Poppy, and my partner here, Julian Blaue, we were celebrating it in Rio de Janeiro with her big brother, Bela. After dinner, we decided to go into town. We wanted to explore this city, and Julian had this vision that we should go to this upper-class lake called Lagoa, where there was a beautiful Christmas tree in the middle of the lake, and on top of the three very famous mountains, there is this Cristo Redentor, the world's biggest Jesus sculpture. And it's kind of blessing the whole town. So we were on our way there, but to get there, there was a little dark park, only a few hundred meters. And at that point, I, I felt like, no, I, I want to turn around. But Julian pushed because we were so close to our dream in a way. And everything went fine, so we had champagne and we were just really so happy. It was only on the way back that we got robbed by two poor men from a favela close by and they had a huge knife and asked us to give them everything. And of course we just threw everything to them, gave them everything and thank God we actually survived and even got all our things back from the police later. But something in us died, I would say. And through this violent experience, we understood something about poverty in the world, something about the violent structures. And this is what we want to share with you on our next performance at Sörlandes Kunstmuseum. This Wednesday at 7 o'clock, our world got shaken and we hope we can maybe shake yours a little bit too.